guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really really well today. Um, I'm aware I look like a complete mess. I have no makeup on, my hair thrown up into this scruffy ponytail, but this is all because I'm on my way to the hairdressers in not too long. But I received a parcel this morning and so in here is the stuff, well the box that I ordered from, oh, that I ordered from Birchbox and I had already decided that I was going to open it on camera for you guys and I could not wait so even though I look a mess this is happening. Um, so as you guys can see it's still in its like delivery box, I haven't even took it out of here to get into the normal box yet so everything is 100% organic, organic is that the right word? First impressions anyway, um, so yeah I'm really excited so let's just crack into it. Why is this such a hard box to open? Oh! Oh! This is adorable! So on the inside it says hello beautiful and then the Birchbox logo, I am loving all of this pink and um, it was a special code, discount code, offer code, whatever you want to call it um, but the first thing that I can see is this pixie glow mist so it's a nourishing mist, hydrant and protector it is paraben free and not tested on animals which I think is the standard for everything that comes from the Pict C brand or range or whatever, you... yeah. I do believe this retails for £16, I paid £13 for the box including delivery and this was like a nice little code that you could add onto it to get for free so I'm very excited to use that. Now to get into the actual box. This is so pretty! Ah oh, yes, this is the box which I wanted. So this is the Disney Frozen Birch Box collaboration. And there was two different um, designs of the Birch Box outer. This is the one that I did have my eye on to be perfectly honest with you, um, so I am very excited about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with it afterwards, but I am going to find a use of it somewhere. But literally just to start with, I think this looks adorable. Let's crack into it. So it opens like a little drawer. So obviously this is advertising Frozen 2 which is in cinemas on November the 22nd. So in here guys is a little bit of everything about the information of the items within the box. So the first thing is this Seba Med Sensitive Skin Moisturising Body Lotion for normal skin. Interesting. It, lit it literally says sensitive skin for normal skin. Hydrate sensitive skin. Okay, so I'm gonna say this is like normal as in not oily, not dry and then sensitive skin just in general. So after cleansing thoroughly, massage the lotion gently into the skin and this says Okay, this is definitely not a full size, it is only 15mm, um, but apparently the bigger size is... The bigger size will retail for £14.50. Yeah, so it's just a tiny little bottle. Moisturises the skin, making it firm and smooth. It doesn't really have a scent at all which with everything that it's claiming I would expect. I'd be a bit worried if it claimed all of this stuff and then had a very noticeable scent. But yeah, I'll be trying that. Next I have the Not Free Forever Jamaican Black Castor Oil 
detangler so this is a spray and so after washing the hair I will apply this general, generously and work through tangled areas with a wide tooth comb. I mean my hair is terrible for getting knots in it. It'll be fine for ages and then there'll just be this big clump which has appeared from nowhere and it'll just be the biggest pain to get out and every time I'll debate cutting it out and yeah. This hopefully should help. Oh! Oh shit! Okay, so I thought that was going to be a spray and it's kind of like... It's kind of like a cream in a spray bottle so instead of it like misting it just kind of shoots out and I'm not 100% sure where that went. I'll find it later. This is six pounds at retail price. Next we have a Bodyography lip pencil in Heatherberry and that looks like a really nice shade actually. This one is full sized as well. Oh I like that. So I only did a tiny little line. I don't know how well you'll be able to see it but it's just like a nice little mauvey kind of colour and then obviously if you wanted to it does smudge out as well. I quite like that. I quite like neutralish shades and with it being winter I might want to kind of heatherberry it up a bit. So yeah, I'm looking forward to using that as well. Wow, okay. So with the birch box you get an email and you can choose between two different shades of a certain product. This month's was the Lies Waiter lipstick. I chose gingerbread. I can't really remember what the other one was but I chose gingerbread um, and I knew this one wasn't going to be full size but it's literally the same length as my nose. I expected it to be bigger than this, you know? Let's have a go. Okay, so this is it fully rolled up, which is still tiny. I mean, it, it looks like a lovely colour, but you do only get 0 0.05 ounces of this. So it won't last the longest, but let's do a swatch anyway. Okay, so this one here is the swatch of gingerbread. Now, I did expect it to be a bit more pigmented, but it is more sheer. I do quite like it though, and it's got quite a glossy texture and finish on top so I do think that's really pretty and um, the lip liner was a bit darker but I think if you faded out the lip liner you could make the two work together and have a bit of a lip look with those and then last but not least is the incredible sparkle like a unicorn illuminating sheet mask now I am so excited to use this face mask. I love doing masks anyway, but I do love unicorns as well. I feel like everything, everyone has at least one thing which no matter how old you get, you don't grow out of. And mine is unicorns. So I am very excited to try this and become who I truly am. I don't even think words can come close. I am so excited to try this. Even if it wasn't a sheet mask, I feel like I'd just be excited about anything unicorn because I do have a little bit of a soft spot for anything which is unicorn patterned or themed or anything like that. So yeah. So that concludes everything that I got within the birch box. I will do a little bit of a close up of all the stuff that I've got right now. Um, do remember that the Pixie Glow Mist that I got was not part of the box, it was like a, a, an added extra. Yes, that is everything that I got there. I am really happy with the Birch Box actually. I have had a look at it for a few months and I never went through with the purchase, but this one 
I have been really really happy with I think it's really good value for money and I will use everything that's inside it I don't know if I'll go on to order December's I'll have to maybe see what comes in it first because I don't really see the point of purchasing these boxes if it's just a month worth of stuff which I'm never going to touch so yeah I'll see how that one goes but this Frozen 2 box was amazing and I'm very very happy with it so that brings me to the end of this video then guys I hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below if you'd like to see my face again then make sure to hit that subscribe button and I will see you next time thanks guys